All right. Uh, this is a tray full of uh, dungon latte seeds. As you can see, uh, the seed is uh, covered with a hard uh, shell. Uh, you cannot crush it with your hand. There's a keel on top, and dungon latte is a Philippine hardwood. The scientific name is uh, Heritiera litoralis. It is known to grow in mangrove areas, so in its natural distribution, it is more often found along shorelines near mangrove areas. Now, uh, from an evolutionary point of view, the structure of the seed is said to favor floating, flotation on the sea surface with a keel up. Now, since it's like a sphere or a, an, an, an oblong shaped uh, in, uh, case enclosing the seed, it can travel long distances until it reaches a shoreline and germinates. The bowl of this tree is not very long. It's a medium-sized tree, but it is, uh, according to Burkle, probably the toughest Malayan timber. And uh, according to the source of this seed, which is actually uh, the owner of this, uh, from where I got the seeds, is uh, in Aliaga, Nueva Ecija. So it's, uh, as you can see, uh, to those who are familiar with this area, uh, farther inland. So this species can adapt itself to areas far away from this shoreline. And um, um, the tree is buttressed by uh, buttress roots that are known to grow into wall-like structures that uh, uh, go around uh, areas of the trunk. So, from a historical uh, viewpoint, the Dungon Latte has been known to be used by our ancestors as a mass of boats and also in boat making if a straight enough bowl can be found. So, um, um, most uh, dendrologists would say this is not endangered, but uh, considering the greed of man, when it comes to finding resources, uh, man is the only species prob probably that does not disengage when satiated. So, pardon my uh, rant. Uh, the leech diseng disengages from the host once it is uh, satiated with the blood of the host. But uh, Homo sapiens is probably the only species known to collect far more than it needs. Well, anyway, going back to this tree, uh, this is an endless source of fascination for me, especially the the seed. So we're going to try to germinate this once again. I actually had several but they died not because of uh, uh, fastidiousness of the tree but rather because I forgot to water them for a long period and since uh, as you can see over there that line of seedlings there are some dry ones. Uh, some of those dry ones are the Heritiera seedlings which I forgot to water for uh, weeks and they died. Well anyway, this is a new effort to germinate more seeds. I actually have uh, several sacks of them and I'm giving some to a friend. So actually I have uh, other 
seeds here. I went on a seed collecting spree at the State University. Uh, I hope this summer will be worth, uh, worthwhile, dendrology-wise.